Hello everybody. This video is about the GPS vehicle over and how time information is transmitted from the satellites. Because this is a bit difficult to understand, I built some tools to make things clearer. Although the GPS system can be used for very accurate timing, no data is available for a GPS receiver about month, year or day. Time is counted in weeks and seconds of a week since the very first start of the GPS system, which was on May 6, 1980. A 10-bit binary number is transmitted from the satellites for the week number. This is how binary numbers are read. All bits set to 1 means 1 plus 2 plus 4 plus 8 plus 16 plus 32 plus 64 plus 128 plus 256 plus 512, which is 1023 altogether. So week number 0 up to week number 1023 can be counted. Now this is what happens at week number roll over. All bits set to 1 flip to 0 with a 1 normally set in front of them, representing 1024. But because of the limitation to 10 bits, this information gets lost and a new week cycle starts with week number 0. This happens approximately every 19 years and 7 and a half months. The first week all over was on August 22, 1999. The second on April 7, 2019. Now, what does this mean for the use of older GPS equipment? A GPS receiver has to be programmed to interpret the actual week number. For example, the Megalan Trailblazer was manufactured around 1993. When it is switched on for the first time with data lost, it will display the date May 6, 1980, which was the start of the GPS system. This is a bit funny, because this was 13 years before production of the Trailblazer. When satellite data is available, the week number is used for setting the date. Because the Trailblazer was developed in the early 90s, it will expect to be at the end of the first week cycle or the beginning of the second week cycle. Unfortunately, it gets stuck in this time. Now, February 6, 2022, and week number 148, the Trailblazer shows the date June 23, 2002. This makes some additional features of GPS units useless, like sunrise, sunset times or moon phases. There should be no problem with navigation itself, but the GPS system is used for providing time and date too. In 2019, the flight management system was not prepared for the week rollover, what caused flight cancellations and delays. To deal with this problem, the week counter was extended to 13 bits. The added 3 bits can be regarded as a week cycle counter. It takes some time until 2137 before the 13 bit counter resets to zero. This will solve the problem, but only for new GPS receivers that are programmed to work with 13 bits. I witnessed the last week all over in 2019 and to my surprise all units I powered up were completely unaffected and still worked properly. Positioning kept running and the date was displayed as expected. There is one unit that shows the GPS time in weeks and seconds, the Trimble Scout or Scout Master. Finally, you can catch a glimpse at this historic moment I captured on video. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave comments or questions. Bye.